The average price for a gallon of gas is up nearly $2 from just a year ago, with no signs of slowing down. That's straining wallets and souring Americans on the state of the economy. Lauren Blanchard has more from Washington. Eye-popping numbers. The average gas price for a gallon is nearly $4.92, according to AAA, 30 cents higher than just a week ago. Diesel is also at a record high of $5.68 on average. It's painful to go to the gas station, and I think we're all just feeling that. It's an across-the-country problem. Some states are feeling it more than others, California by far faring the worst with gas prices. Tuesday, the Treasury Secretary was before Congress just days before the next inflation report is released. Lawmakers are trying to figure out how the government can bring relief for families stretched thin. Through um, an historic release um, of a million barrels a day from the strategic petroleum reserve and um, energy prices, gas prices, while very high, have risen a lot, they would be higher without that. There's growing pessimism over the state of the economy as a whole. A Wall Street Journal poll showed 83% of Americans describe the economy as poor or not good. And there's criticism that the administration is not doing enough to bring down gas prices. We understand there's more work to be done, uh, but we are continuing to take steps and we are encouraged because of where we are economically. We're going to do everything that we can to attack inflation. Already drivers in more than a dozen states are paying over $5 a gallon. Analysts say $6 on average could be coming this summer. In Washington, Lauren Blanchard, Fox News.